Okay, so today I'm going to do my mission inspiration on the back of this card. This is still wet, so I've just finished that video. Now, <clears throat> for February, the mini, the mid-month mini mission inspiration is from the Rihanna song, Shine Bright Like a Diamond. I'm not really a fan of Rihanna. I won't lie. But this prompt is going to give me... Well, I've already got some ideas for this. Um, I'm adding the black gesso onto this purple page. And it's kind of worked out really great that I've got this purple on the back to work with. Um, because a lot of your sparkle mediums and things like that work great on a dark background so I'm going to use the black gesso and just get rid of any white that's showing through and then we're going to get out some sparkle get our bling on don't know exactly where I'm going with this but I know this is where I want to start, with a nice dark base to really show off those sparkly mediums, whatever I use. I might use my Cosmic Shimmer uh, watercolour paints. I have tubs and tubs of glitter that I can use. Booty background, doesn't it? Isn't it? I'm not putting it on very thick, I'm just dabbing a little bit on, so it's kind of drying as we go. Which is good, that means I can get on with it. a nice quick video, although as I say I have no idea what I'm doing today. Uh. There we go. <coughs> I think I'm just going to go and wash the brush. Uh, yeah, wash the brush. And I'll be back. My battery is flashing at me, so I might have to dig out my charger too. <laughs> okay. So I've got that my cosmic shimmers. And I'm going to spray. Now, I think I'm going to stick mostly with the purples. And my brush is dry, it should be wet, never mind. Oops, some, oh, didn't make that. be a bit galaxy like I think <laughs> little bit of the black and 
put a little bit, well, quite a bit of glue on there as well. It's fine. There we go. And then I'm going to dry that off and figure out what we do next. Okay, so it's a little bit. Let's open again now. Oh, oh dear. There we go. It's a little bit concentrated over here, so I'm just going to add a little bit more. Up here. Oh, for goodness sakes. <laughs> Ay, yeah, Black, maybe. There we go. And this brush paper rinse out in a minute. <coughs> and we'll try it again and I'll be back. Okay, so I thought I was going to go in a different direction with this, but. I think I'm going to stick to Galaxy theme. Grab some silver paint. There we go, sorry about that. I had to shut the door. Now. So we've got some silver paint. Sending the pound shop so it's not very opaque or thick but hopefully it will do so I'm gonna have to keep talking to try and drown out the Noise from next door, my sister's got her computer on while well, she's cleaning. And I don't want you to be able to hear what she's listening to. I don't want a YouTube strike. <laughs> so, <clears throat> yeah, I'm not sure I want a lot on this page to be honest. Let's think. Now, my difficult part is going to be the next step because I want to stamp on here, but because of that um, chipboard on the other side of the page, it's going to be tricky. No, this is the other way, right? This is looking really nice. Just like a tiny bit up in this corner. And a tiny bit more down here. A little bit, and now I'm going to dry that off. And I'll be back. Okay, oops, so absolute chaos behind me. <laughs> I'm off this week, so I'm gonna have a good time up of my room. 
Uh, and I'm going to try this. Try. Just hope that this doesn't hurt. Uh, what am I thinking? Um, melt. I'm going to heat it. <clears throat> so. Ink it up, pigment stamp, it's a clear pigment for embossing. Hopefully, I'll be able to see. Let's get that again. Not, I'm really not sure how this is going to work out. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work. So that looks good so far. Let's get this back in the book. Lid on, or spill it. Wet. <coughs> mm. Oh, I don't know. I'm so nervous. I really want this to work because it looks cool. Here we go. <coughs> <coughs> Works really well, actually. Um, cool. Now I'm going to want my matte medium. Pop a bit there. around the stump just to get rid of the excess
quickly go around the letters with some black just to help them pop and remember when you're heating this you have just heat embossed these letters so don't let the heat go on it for too long or she will dull and burn your embossing powder so just waggle it over just to get that medium a little bit more dry and try and stay quite high up so you're not like right over it and burning it as I say So I will try and talk over the noise of the vacuum for a minute and I'm going to grab out another stencil uh, da, da, da. I did have it, here it is, right and this just has these little I don't know what you would call those little shapes and I'm going to use this new chalk marker Oh, I don't know what happened there. I don't like it. It's kind of bled, I think. Um, okay. Try and rub some of that off. It's a chalk marker, so hopefully it should come off. Just try a little bit. Dump on me. Okay, so maybe not through the stencil, let's just try these sort of little you know. Gently, so as not to go on the other side. I think that is going to be it for my interpretation of the Shine Bright Like a Diamond inspirational quote or whatever you want to call it. Um, tea. <laughs> now, I'm just going to grab a white pen if I can find one that works. And pop 
the date on, which is again the 17th of Feb 2019. And that is a very, very shiny page. Shiny, shiny. Love it. There we go, and now I can add that to my pile. Uh, but I wonder, just maybe give it a little bit of a... There we go. And it can go in my little book. There we go. And that's that. I hope you enjoyed that. And I hope you join me again soon. I'm really sorry about the noise next door. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so please check out my other videos and the Mission Inspiration Facebook group. It's lots of fun. Uh, yes, I will leave a link below. So thank you for joining me and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.